Hello and welcome back to the Milk Bar Podcast, the only place on planet Earth where you can watch and listen as six full-grown white men argue in bicker about things like what's the best kind of fat percentage in milk and why can't I get my dad's fucking approval? <laughs> hey. Today on the table we are joined by Simon, Hello. myself, Ellis, Christopher, Oshan and the only one on planet Earth who will never go over ten words on this podcast, Stephen. How are we all doing? Did you forgot Angus times. Frank. Yeah. Oh, that's the sixth person. Me and yeah. when you said six people, me and Stephen were like, "Where the fuck? Who's the sixth person?" Yeah, I was <laughs> waiting for you to mention Angus. I thought it all through. Angus Frank. Oh. Next to the hat, where you can get it for free if you subscribe to the Patreon. Yeah. But rules are in the description. No one's gonna fucking do it. I don't care. <laughs> um, I might do it. I want a hat. <laughs> you subscribe to the Patreon to get a free hat. <laughs> <laughs> which only costs as little as £3 a month, and you can get all sorts of benefits, including free hats and merch. Is that what you would do? Oh, tell me more about it. No. Oh. <laughs> okay, I'm mad. I'm, I'm that was very good, Alice. Thank you. I'm, I think well, we should give him a round of applause. What a good Stern start. Clap. That just reminds me of my drama teacher in high school. Well, she gave you the line, clap. Haven't I? Is that how many times he... No. Shagged your ass. Okay. I don't like to talk about it. Well, Sorry. Cake. <laughs> <laughs> throw back. Um, throw it back. Yeah. Um, oh, <laughs> I've had too much caffeine. So, how are we all? Still tired. All right. <laughs> Moving I'm on. Good. This is story of the week. I'm good. Yeah. All right. I'm good. Cool. Yeah. What are you asked? Anything, you, anything else you want to put in? Um, I just want to say that I'm good. Oh, I'm happy about One that. One clap. <laughs> <laughs> Don't give me the clap. What? No. Hmm? Uh, right, so story of the week. A segment where some of the milkmen volunteered to tell a story of something that's happened to them recently or in the past. Then we, the milkmen, will decide which is the best story of this week. So, I'm going to volunteer Simon, because <laughs> I know he hasn't <laughs> thought of a story, <laughs> to tell a story. He'd be right. I haven't. Um, what did you do last week? Fuck oh, cool. all. <laughs> <laughs> I've got loads of stories. I could tell you, oh, do you want to hear a story when like, I fell off a 10-foot wall? <laughs> I mean, in fairness, I'm not that tall for you. You're like <laughs> no, six but it foot... was back then, mate. I was oh, a small right. child. <laughs> when you were six foot three. Yeah. <laughs> Go for it. So, we were breaking it. No, we weren't. <laughs> we, were going, we, were, we were going along this wall, right? It was near, ha- near our house in this, in this like wooded area. <clears throat> There's a big wall. We were walking along the top of it for some reason. And <laughs> like as I stepped on this one bit, like rocks fell and I fell with them. Oh nice. And all that was down there was another pile of rocks <laughs> and just nettles and thorns and everything. And I fell and landed straight on my back and I was like screaming in pain and I was like I was like I was just stuck there. And I like cuts all over my body and I was just screaming for my, my mates to help. One of them one of my mates, Jack, who was behind me when I fell was just stood staring at me <laughs> I was like screaming I was like help me please help me and he was like <laughs> that sounds like Jack like, Jack, Jack Wills yeah, yeah yeah he just he was just stood there just watching me in pain <laughs> oh nice <laughs> so I had to get myself out and climb back up the wall and I was like covered in blood like my back was like bad and like I'd fallen on rocks so I was like my spine was snapped no it wasn't snapped but <laughs> I was just in a lot of pain mate. <laughs> and I had to like walk home and it was, it's not far from my house. It's literally about five, six minutes from my house. And it felt like hours. Right? I was like, because ah. <laughs> <laughs> I was only a small boy. Yeah. And it really fucking hurt. How old were you? I was like, I was like 12. nine, 10, something like that. Bloody hell. Simon, all your stories involve like getting injured or causing <laughs> injuries. Honestly, how are you not dead? <laughs> you would not know the amount of times I've been injured, been near death or have actually died. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, like in episode 10 and 11. Yeah. So... It's, it's, my life has been pretty painful. Mm. <laughs> Not a word I yeah. um, Fucking Christ. Ellis? I've got nothing, but I can quickly show uh, a little show and tell of my uh, farmer's tan if you want me to. Get your tits I'm not, out. I'll get my tits out like Fuck I mentioned sake. last time. I mentioned uh, how badly I got burnt working in locations, and I can just take my watch off and you'll see. Whoa. <laughs> So t- like the comparison between me. I know you guys went to I fucking IB yeah. and <laughs> look at that. <laughs> yeah, and in fairness, it was fucking hotter here than yeah. in yeah. Ibiza. We went Ibiza clocked, and it was like right? cloudy. Yeah, and on what day? It clocked twenty six degrees where it was, which is fucking. It was hot when we were. It just wasn't sunny. 
It was oh, it was, it was only like the last day, yeah. was it? Mm. That's when I Security got, guard mm. at the airport asked me, like, where's my tan? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe yeah, I, don't don't tan. I think you could be in the centre of the sun, you wouldn't tan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know, but... You just you, look like fucking Dr. Yeah, Manhattan. No one else was tanned, though, really. <laughs> what are you on about? We were all tanned. You just decided you tanned, to stay Chris? in the shadows. I was like... You, I mean, he was definitely tanned. Yeah, He's tan. not as tanned now. Yeah. But you were the only one that didn't because you sat in the shadows all the whole time. Yeah, because I'm not sitting in the sun for like five hours. It's like boring. <laughs> you're boring. <laughs> got him. You're boring. Any stories off him? Of course he's got stories. I don't know. I'm still trying to think. Do I you want, want to shit share. yourself on command right now? Just <laughs> no, no, no. I've got, got, yeah. He probably could do it. I don't want to risk it. I'm just, <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to try. It takes a little bit of force. Yeah, there. the amount of PSI down there is just <laughs> off the fucking, it's off it's the more, scales. So It's more than that submarine there from... Okay. Don't make it. Let's <laughs> not relate my arsehole to five people dead, Chris. Do you know what yeah. I mean? Have some respect. <laughs> uh, I've got a quick story, unless you've got one that you thought of. No, I can't think of any. Okay, so um, this is a, this is a nice little throwback. So when we went to Liverpool, but the uh, yeah, the, the the first time we went, mm. and uh, we were staying like a little bit outside of Liverpool. We weren't staying in the centre. Yeah, it was a mm. travel lodge, right? Yeah. yeah, and then um, and instead I would drive. I was like driving in. And then, uh, on the way, <laughs> <laughs> we don't know where this is, <laughs> and we love you. <laughs> so, on the way in, I'm obviously like, my, I'm following the sat nav, and it was kind of one of those moments where you're like blindly following it, like regardless of actually what's going on around you. Yeah. So the sat nav was like, you need to be in the right lane. So we entered into some roadworks, and the sat nav was like, you need to get over into, over into the right lane. And I was like, oh fuck, this lane's gonna take me off to the left here. So I went, I looked around to him and I went, all right, boys, it's time to do something illegal. And I went like in between the cones to get onto the right lane. And then as I'm driving up, we get to like a set of traffic lights. I'm like, hang on a minute, what's like, what is going on here? And like, why is that left lane not filtered left? Next minute, there's a bus coming <laughs> right towards us. And I was sat uh, like in the oncoming, oncoming traffic. Yeah. yeah. And I had to pull in and cut in front of everybody. So it looked like I was just a right dick. Cutting the la- cutting the like jump in the key. You were. It, it was, but that wasn't my intention. I'm an innocent man. You literally said, fuck it, I'm going to do something illegal. How was <laughs> yeah. that not your intention? The evidence has stacked against me. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> <laughs> doesn't look good. No. But yeah, and I was just like, just dying. It was so funny and obviously like embarrassing because there's like a it bus coming. You were like, like panicking, like, where do I go? Where do I, go? <laughs> I was in the passenger seat. I, was, I, was, I nearly passed out from laughter. I was like, it was so funny. <laughs> I'm not sure if you even remember, but like on the incoming traffic, a police car came by as well. Oh yeah, that was like just after, wasn't it? So yeah. I didn't even, like luckily, I didn't even see. Yeah, it. imagine, honestly. How it, yeah, yeah. So that was, that was a good so time. Funny, that. It just yeah. tells what kind of driver you are, really. Mm, it's, yeah, I don't think I was necessarily a bad driver. It was a case of I was just following the sat nav. I was like, like, you know, the people the that drive. The roadworks that were there, it wasn't very clear yeah. what was happening. Yeah, yeah. and it's like they put you in, the roadworks actually put you in the right lane, if that makes sense, because yeah, of like, what was going on. So it was just a little bit like a. I was like one of those people, you know, you hear about people driving into lakes and things, <laughs> <Yeah>. following <laughs> the sat nav. That was me. <laughs> but I, yeah, I voluntarily went, ah, oh, you know what? Fuck it. But yeah. Into Shit the happens. oncoming traffic. Yeah, but no one died. We were all all right. Didn't get arrested. But just later. about. Yeah. So, yeah. So, that was a good time, wasn't it? It's crazy because I, I think we could, like, agree that he's probably the safest driver here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and he does this shit. <laughs> Do you know what I, I mean? I did it safely. Do you know what I mean? You know. And we skipped the queue. You know what? I'll do it again. Yeah, you <laughs> literally cut in front of everyone and it was on a red light. <laughs> you just reversed back in front of the red light. Like That was, all, that was a big like line as well. Like, yeah, he went It wasn't like two or three wild. cars. That yeah, was like yeah. ten cars. Just, weird. just, what is this dickhead doing? And then a bus. <laughs> so, just a mess. Steve, yeah. you got any stories to tell? No. Any driving stories? Keep the trend going. Oh, yeah. I'll try and think of one. Driving. No, I drive the speed limit. <laughs> Are you sure about that? He doesn't. You drive like 10 mile an hour under it. No, I like. don't. I never do that. I never make it up. I drive the speed limit. Mm. You don't. <laughs> no, because I'm not boring. I want to get to the, I want to get to the place I'm going. You know what I mean? But then you also you don't you don't look at the speedometer, do you? You look at your um, sat nav, which tells me I'm doing the speed limit. <laughs> He's, He's wrong here, point. isn't he? He well, shouldn't be looking at the speed on the, on the car. Tells you how far, yeah. uh, fast it's you're like going. It's like plugs in the back. Yeah, it's oh. got like a 
a digital know, thing. I do that. I don't believe Because everyone else's cars got a digital one, but my car just has a normal one. Mm-hmm. But the sat-nav is a digital one. Yeah, I'd still trust your car. But they're going the same speed. <laughs> like, <laughs> He's got a point. They are moving together. <laughs> they don't. Oh. I've been in this car. He goes He's 10, he goes 10 <laughs> over the limit, so he thinks I'm going 10 yeah. under. That's why I don't go 10 so over, mate. i got like at least 30. <laughs> <laughs> Get it right, yeah. Steve. Oh, I yeah. still haven't been caught, though. That's crazy, actually. Like oh, the your illustration is. See- <laughs> <laughs> no, the amount of speeding that I theoretically do, mm. I should have been caught at least once. Allegedly. Yeah, mm. yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. yeah, all. Yeah. I had my fingers crossed, so it doesn't count. That's what you're going to tell the police. <laughs> That's the move. Well, to, be, to be fair, no. so I'm, I'm kind of pissed, to be yeah, honest. In my defense, <laughs> I am off my fucking head, mate. <laughs> And I was on the phone as well. Was, you know, I was eating a sandwich, so <laughs> just kind of forgot to look at the speed. Yeah, I don't think I ever. Oh, I suppose I kind of do have some car stories, but I'm not going to disclose whether this is true or not because it might get me in trouble. Um, well, I used to work. Let's say theoretically, I used to. <laughs> I used to work at a garage that sold cars. It's been a few times where, because I'd have to move the cars around, you know. The, the garage, uh, theoretically. Um, I loved that. And, uh, yeah, there was, you know, a few times that I accidentally fucked him into a wall. Um, <laughs> and then there was a turntable, I think, theoretically, where I would have to, theoretically, take photos of these cars to, theoretically, advertise online. And um, I remember the, well, I, I think, from what I imagine... Uh, the a bonnet was up in the air and then I turned the turntable and then the bonnet hit the fucking light in the ceiling. Um, yeah, of course, thousands of pounds worth of <laughs> That's a good story, yeah. fictitious story. Yeah, yeah I made it up completely. Mm, None of that, that was yeah, based on fact. the hypothetical story was pretty good. Mm. I suppose it doesn't really count. Mm, can't, yeah. It was all true. <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember that? Just to tell another car story. Do you remember that time yeah. where we went to a McDonald's and it was like <laughs> late at night. I oh, parked my yeah. car in like empty space, miles away from everybody. And then next thing is, in what's the guy goes, oh, has anyone got a, a red golf? And I was like, oh, I've got a red golf. He goes, yeah, that guy just fucking drove into it. And he, <laughs> yeah. And he just, oh, what <laughs> the yeah. fuck, what? Yeah. 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 Everyone went outside and left their food and I brought my food and was eating outside. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, and then, yeah, literally empty car park, completely empty. And it was like nine at night. It was like, you know, it was just dead. And the, the the yeah, I was like the one guy in the car park, and he still hit me. Yeah, <laughs> and he was like trying to go around him. He, yeah. he, he was like a nice guy. He didn't see. He, yeah. he didn't do it on purpose. No, it wouldn't, no, it would have been. What about the second? What about the second guy that hit into you? Yeah, so I've had a, I've had quite a couple. I've had a couple of people actually hit into me <laughs> for some reason. I've never actually crashed into anyone myself. Bad driver. That's what it is. <laughs> so I was going up like the uh, high street in Pristatin, and it's like up a hill, and then the traffic like backed up all the way from the lights. So I was just sat there waiting. Next minute, a guy just fucking just drives straight into the back of me. <laughs> what the fuck? Like, and there was no, like, it wasn't like I slammed on the brakes or anything. And then there was like a, I was literally sat there. There was a good, like, delay. And then next minute, he just fucking drove straight into the back why, of me. Why are you telling me all this when you want my lift home? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're dead. You want to die. Don't worry, I'll drive you, mate. Don't worry. Thanks. I don't want to die. <laughs> yeah, I feel like, I don't know what it is. I've, like I said, I don't crash into anybody myself. Mm. But people just aim for me. It's yeah, weird. That's the same for me. I've been in two car accidents, haven't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because one of them was just a drunk driver reversing into my car. Yeah. And then the other one was me getting hit on the roundabout. And just wrote your car off, didn't Wrote you? my car off, yeah. Dang. I remember you sending me videos of that. And I was like, well, it looks like you're in the wrong. <laughs> 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 yeah, but I remember you saying about that second guy that hit into the back of you. I remember you going, ah, to be honest, mate, I'm more pissed off that I spilt my monster everywhere. <laughs> yeah, I had a drink. I had just opened it. Yeah. Just literally fresh. And then, because of the hit, it just went everywhere, all over my dash. And I was just like, oh, I was going to drink that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then he didn't pay, did he? It was a yeah. bit, oh, it was a whole dilemma, because it was like, the first guy, I'm like, oh, you know, we'll, we'll go for insurance, we'll just sort it out. He paid for it, fine, it's all sorted, sound. Did the same for the next guy. He didn't pay. And then when I, like, went through insurance, they're like, he hasn't even got insurance. Oh, but he I'm gave not... me all the right details, yeah. the, the Muppet, like. But yeah. My guy wasn't even insured either. Wild. It's mental, isn't it? The amount of people that go around driving yeah. like knobheads. Yeah. <laughs> Hang on. 
You know, you'd sure never catch me no. doing anything like that. <laughs> no. I avoid them. No, you don't get caught doing it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I've I've hit into it. Let's be fair. Mm. The thing that we should fear the most is when Simon gets a license. I'd be a well good driver. No, you wouldn't. <laughs> what do you mean? Mate, you would not give a fuck. You would literally go on the pavement and just start running cunts over just because you're like, I don't like your trousers. Well, I don't have shit trousers. <laughs> <laughs> Fair point. All right, well, story of the week. Who's won this week? What um, were they again? So Simon's wall. Me fell off a wall. Oh, the wall's wall, like an hour ago. My tan. <laughs> <laughs> you I are? my tan. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, oh well. In breaking the law in Liverpool. Oh yeah. Yeah. yeah, you break, yeah. I think it's crazy. Yeah, 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 you're right. It's got to be in it. What was yours again? Just remind me. Just, Just being a shit driver. Yeah. yeah. So it's definitely Chris. What? Yeah. <laughs> cool. Well done, Chris. Uh, I won one. Nice one. Why are you so weird? I didn't All right. Fist bump. Um, Ellis, because you're the host, I didn't actually <laughs> offer you last week. Sorry, Simon. But do you want to do the? Uh, <laughs> Sorry, you looked so dead inside for a second then. Do you want to do the next segment? I can read it, but I'm not going to do it successfully. All right, we're at segment two. Just read it backwards, doesn't it? <laughs> if you want to become a Milkman founder, check out milkman.shop. With limited edition hoodies, t shirts, caps, and more, Milkman Original will keep you cuddly, warm, and cozy. With free shipping over orders, £69. <laughs> Got him. Uh, across the UK, purchase any product and you'll be labelled as a Milkman founder. Make sure to check out the merch at Milkman. Mer- no, Milkman.shop. Sorry, oh. I nearly fucked that. Mate, it's your, so it's your own well. fucking company, love. <laughs> <laughs> right. Say? Cool. Yeah, go and buy the merch uh, so we can keep doing this and not go <laughs> bankrupt. Uh, anyone got any news? That was really in tune. Thank you. And we got the news. <laughs> <laughs> that, how was that? Luke Keys. Luke Keys. Anyone who's joined into just this episode is going to be like, what the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> Check out last week's episode. Uh, anyone got any news? Oh, I got some news. Something that I did. Okay. Mm. I played Bus Simulator 21. <laughs> oh my God. You were j- I thought you were joking. What? <laughs> you texted me the other day. I'm like, playing Bus Simulator. <laughs> I thought you were taking the piss. <laughs> I was playing it, mate. Sick. You got to, like lower the bus and not on the curb and let them all get on. <laughs> Give them the tickets. Why are you doing a nine to five job in your spare time? <laughs> <laughs> I'm addicted to it, mate. I'm a workaholic. I feel like we should all play uh, farming simulator. Yeah, we've talked about this. It'd be an like, awful idea. Mm. You're literally farm. playing bus simulator. <laughs> Way better. No, but the thing is, I'm not good on games like farming simulator. Because we'll build up this whole empire. Because get so boring. That's like, it's like Minecraft, isn't it? I'll get bored and just start destroying shit. Yeah. No, that's kind of the point. And you'll all be upset with me. That's kind like, of the point. Like, you can actually hit into other cars. Yeah, I do as well. You can hit into animals. And, and you see Chris just driving towards you. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, she's not meant to do it. <laughs> um, right, well, that, that was some... Yeah, I'm che- glad you shared that. Good Fuck. news. Cheers for that. Brilliant. You're welcome. Uh, anyone else? No? 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 No. Okay, right. I'll just do everything around there. Um, Well, I mean, I don't know whether this is fucking worth mentioning, but the Royal Navy investigates after official documents were found in Weatherspoons. Did you hear about this? Oh, yeah. Yeah, You did? I did hear about this. Why don't you bring it up then? Fucking selfish twat. Shut up, mate. Do you know what I mean? It's because I knew you had it written down there, so I didn't want to. Oh, did you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's next then after this? I only read that bit. (laughs) (laughs) Uh, according to the sun so take this with a pinch of salt the files carry details about HMS Anson one of the Navy's most advanced vessels the paper paper says the files were left in the Furnace Railway pub in Barrow in Furness uh, with a source saying they were found on the floor of a toilet cubicle good news Mm. yeah this is like there's fuck all going on in the world (laughs) like there's literally nothing (laughs) This is the best the, I've got. The, the, the stuff that's going on in the world is it has been going on. So like we, we just can't keep talking about the same shit. Yeah, yeah. we've got to talk about pieces of paper left on the toilet floor. <laughs> Literally, <you know? laughs> there's fuck all else going on in this world. Like we can't talk about Titanic because they're all dead. Can't talk about Putin because he's still fucking being a dickhead, isn't he? <laughs> what else is there? Do you know what I mean? Oh, interest rate. My girlfriend says this one, so let's blame it on her. Interest rates for her, her mortgages are going up. Damn. Yeah, no, there's I mean, fuck all I mean, else going on. <laughs> there's literally nothing going on. 
a mad how, how did you find this story did you actually read the song or did you just get desperate? no i went on bbc i was like world news and it was like fuck all mate just go <laughs> over just stop just looking up. at our website um but question related to this yeah how much money would it take for you to blow a guy huh <laughs> what oh, everyone's got a toilet cubicle uh, uh that yeah completely that's where i was going with it. how much is fredo or? these days Put him. How much is a Freddo these days? 39p, maybe? Yeah, 39p. <laughs> <laughs> no, like, actually. Uh, that just reminds me of the... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> okay, right? Yeah. I gave you like, my answer. Yeah. Do you want a serious answer? You remind me of that, guy, uh, that joke where the guy goes, yeah, there's, like, there's a homeless guy out there saying, I'll give head for, like, <laughs> a cheeseburger <laughs> and a Sprite or whatever. And then he's got a cheeseburger yeah. and a Sprite. <laughs> I think five grand. Maybe five. What? Uh, hold on. What was the question? I've yeah, really blocked out here. You've got to get down on your knees and give the most sloppy toppy you've ever given. <laughs> five grand is a mad number, you know. As in too much or too little? Way too much. <laughs> <laughs> um, like bare minimum. And he's a good-looking lad as well. He's not, you know, he's clean. Someone gave me like a tenner. A tenner. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're all just checking our pockets. Like, huh? Yeah. Uh, you got a note right now. I'll tear it up live. Not the note. You <laughs> <laughs> He's actually got a tenner. Um, do you want us to leave you to it? or <laughs> This will be on the other version. This is the ASMR section of the whole This podcast. is the audio bit. <laughs> this is just going to be blurred out now. For your side, it's just blurred out. You just hear 10 minutes straight. <laughs> Look, he's even got a, a bobble to get your hair out of your face. Don't have any hair. Beard. <laughs> <laughs> Your beard. Oh. So tenner, five grand. Hang on, what was the question? To blow a guy. Oh my God, how much money to suck on someone's cock? What are you saying? Like? What has this got to do with the Royal Navy? Mate, the toilet thing. Mm. Just, yeah, just we don't want to talk about the fucking Royal Navy anymore. <laughs> we do want to talk about sucking dick. I'd though. say uh, hundred, hundred. I've got to go big. Hundred quid. <laughs> hundred pennies. Grand. That was hundred. Hundred k. Hundred k. What would you do with that? Hundred k. You know. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, tenner boy. Metal. Hundred k. I think so. That's reasonable. <laughs> but maybe we, maybe we'd barter on it if I saw the guy. <laughs> maybe he'd bring me down to like. Okay, it's like yeah. it's, it's Henry Cavill or Ryan Reynolds. Free. <laughs> <laughs> You'd pay him a ton. <laughs> yeah. Okay, for them. For them though, I'd probably just do it just for, like just a fact. clout. Yeah, yeah. Like, clout, you know. Yeah. All right. What about me? <laughs> <laughs> Two hundred. Yeah. yeah. We didn't pay last time. We what? <laughs> Wait, you guys are getting paid. <laughs> hundred grand. Yeah, I think that's. What would you do with it? Spend it. Suck it. Oh, oh. money. <laughs> 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 Describe in pure detail what you would do. <laughs> you know, you, you can't just like half arse it. You've got to, you know, mm. to completion. You got to cradle, cradle the balls. And... Oh, you can't forget. You can't neglect the balls. We all no, know you that. Can't. We all know that. Yeah. Yeah. What about you, Ashon? Oh, I don't know. Because it's, I mean, it would scar me, for, you know, at least. Yeah, your a mouth week. isn't wide enough. <laughs> yeah. Um,. Come back to me. I'll do some financing in my head. Steve? <laughs> Depends, because Ellis said five grand. And if you're if you're they're paying you to do it, you've got to be good. So you can make a service out of this. <laughs> Why are you, start, are you starting a business? <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's just Mike, got, he's got business plans. Five grand. <laughs> five grand, hey, but he's got a good point. <clears throat> that is a money maker. You're going to set up a fucking like, lemonade stand just on the side <laughs> of the street. Oh, no. So hang on. How much would you charch? I said five grand. But you'd suck multiple. Why don't you just not do... the same time? <laughs> <laughs> no, not at the same time. But... You're saying he... Yeah, yeah, you're no, saying. Just you're just going for your question here. Yeah, yeah. But what you're saying it. So he's instead of he's doing one said... for a hundred, you yeah, do but like... paying hundred k. You got to think. Yeah, but you're saying you do like. It doesn't 20. matter. That's just your. Well, you're not, <laughs> mate. <laughs> Sub two for seven point five. <laughs> Fuck it up. He's doing twenty just to match me. Yeah, yeah literally. Man, you're yeah. like someone will pay. Like... <laughs> Fine, I'll go go hundred k with Chris then. Right. Start a business out of it. <laughs> yours is like appointment based. Why does he want to start a business? <laughs> Why does he want to suck? Yeah. More than one cop. He's like, I don't just do the one. I'm trying to get, I'm get a get guest out of this. So much money. Yeah, yeah, you money. Probably, but you could just say a million or something. But you're like, yeah. no, I, want, I need to do more than one. I need we to build up a, a reputable business. 
Okay, for me, it would probably it would probably be like half a mil, one mil, just something like. Obviously, it would never happen. That's mental. Yeah, if you're gonna uh, you gonna do it, you may as well be like set for life. If yeah, they're gonna yeah. pay whatever they want, you know, pay off, you know, pay off the house, you know, have a nice holiday, find a nice man, suck his dick. Mm. There you go. But here's another question for you, which is related to this one. Right. So that's just only you know, right? Mm-hmm. So you suck a cock, only you know. Yeah. How much to suck a cock and have it filmed and put on the internet? That should quid. bump the numbers up, mm. surely. 20, yeah. Double it. <laughs> <laughs> 20 quid. Because, <laughs> uh, you know, the other, w- the other way, it's only you and the guy that knew. Yeah. How much did, uh, what's her name? Kim Kardashian? Well, she's a... She's got so much money. She, she did it for all the money, though, the, uh, the thing. Isn't Didn't she a billionaire she? now? Is she a billionaire? I have no I idea. Care. I don't follow it. <laughs> all I know is that she did that uh, tape for money. I don't know how much it was. Really? Yeah. Oh. Damn. That's what I think anyway, but um, however much he got for it, probably say the same. What well, if it's like a fiver, though? <laughs> oh, because you could charge people for the footage, couldn't you? If you're you want to make your business. Oh, no, no, no. no. For, you have um, got business on the tube. Yeah. <laughs> no, because you're not the one that's filming it. Uh, it's Henry Cavill. Yeah, right. it's right. them. Okay. Getting the POV. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, it's, it bumps it up a little bit. Mm. Not, not too much, though, I don't mind. 103 grand. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably. I, I'd have to be, like, the richest person on earth. Mm. It's got to be, like, so much money that you're not even bothered by the fact that it's yeah, out there. Like, like, you could just buy new friends. Yeah. <laughs> what? Why did it ruin your friendship? What? If, if a fudge... Of me got like leaked of me sucking like someone's dick. Mate, I would, would you know never, I'm not associating with I anyone. would never be able to walk around with you anywhere. <laughs> I'd just completely rinse you all the time. You'd get sick of it and probably kill yourself. There's there's a Chris, you gotta think about this. If you made a lot of money, yeah, you could just move away. The only people that would know is people that actually know you. But then no who know, wants to say online it doesn't even go popular. It's one view online. No, it definitely goes popular. <laughs> I'd make the sure. The way I do it, well. <laughs> <laughs> the way he's sucking a cock <laughs> it's becoming number one quick um, the numbers I'm seeing for how much Kim Kardashian got for doing the sex tape is <laughs> for roughly one mil but that doesn't include the profits after the fact because I saw a headline that says it still gets 306 no 360k a year from, from sales damn so there's profit to be had 20 quid. Why are we wasting our time making a podcast? We've got the cameras. We've got the... Do you know what I mean? We've we're got off, the equipment. We're yeah. all the cocks. <laughs> yeah. We could have, like, you know, like, Simon's sucking Ellis. Ellis is sucking Chris. Chris is sucking me. I'm not sucking anyone. And then uh, uh, Stephen's shagging Simon. Oh, but I'm the weird one for making a business. <laughs> <laughs> well, listen. Just make a pentagram of cock sucking. Is that what you just Yeah, doing? but I'm just stud. I'm not doing anything. You're just uh, watching. That makes you weirder. You no, I'm having my cock suck. <laughs> Oh, I see. But I'm not participating. Oh, right. So I'm not weird. It's like, is what about... Never mind. Go right. for it. Where go are you go. going with that? Go. <laughs> hit, hit it. If you eat your own cum, right? <laughs> <laughs> go on. Is that gay? Yeah. Have you been... Depends on the situation. <laughs> no. I won't say so. Bear grills. Yeah, survival. That's what I mean. Protein in that or shit. Or just in your bedroom. <laughs> Survival. <laughs> you're locked inside. <laughs> How long are you in this bedroom? No, you've been in there. You, like, you just woke up an hour ago. <laughs> <laughs> There's food in the fridge yeah. downstairs. Oh, a bit <laughs> yeah. Is this is this mm. talking from experience? No. Or? I don't know. Is it gay? You just taste. You just testing the. You're just testing the waters. Yeah. Why? Why are they testing the goods? Like they've done this. You're testing, uh, the, t- yeah, testing the merchandise. Protein in it as well. Yeah. Probably who's that? Recycling it. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> What's the strangest thing you've found in the toilet? <laughs> strangest thing I've found in the toilet? We're going back to the whole Navy thing yeah. about that boring right. shit. Oh, I'll tell you what it was. A bunch of Navy documents that's on the phone. <laughs> 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 Fucking hell. <laughs> uh, uh, where did this thing I found in the toilet? I found a shoe in one once. In a toilet? In a toilet. It was like, it was like you know, like you get the little blocks of toilets, like public toilets. Yeah. yeah. It's got them like minging metal toilets in it. It was just like a shoe in one. Oh, I like covered in piss, and I was like, "I'm <laughs> oh, not going to use this." <laughs> you took the shoe to wear, though, yeah, yeah, yeah. I still got it. 
<laughs> wearing it now. Maybe. <laughs> Still squelches like it did when I found it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fucking <laughs> it's top. You keep it hydrated. Yeah. Right. yeah. <laughs> I was going to say, I don't think I can recall anything weird inside the toilet, but I remember seeing a shit on the side next to the toilet. Mm. I don't remember where that was. That image oh, is I know written. where it was. London oh, Weatherspoons. Yeah, yeah. Do you know why? It was because... Holy fuck, yeah. It yeah. Was. I, I walked in, I think you and Joey were having a piss in the... Um, what are they called? Cubicle. Mm. No, not urinal. cubicle. Urinal. urinal, that's it. Mate, fucking what an idiot. Yeah, urinal. Um, and then I walk in, and everyone else is being quiet, and obviously I've had a pint at this point, so I go, fucking hell, things are shit in here. <laughs> and it did, in fairness, right? And then I, uh, I walk over to the um, sink, because I, I wanted to wash my hands or something, and then I look over to my right, and one of the cubicles, there's a cleaner in there, and I'm like, are you right, mate? And he goes, no. <laughs> Have a look at this. And there's shit on the walls, <laughs> on the back of the toilet, on the fucking cubicle wall, oh, the door, it was on the floor, everywhere. You like took awful. A selfie with yeah, it. I was gonna say, so you took yeah, a so immediately I just started taking <laughs> selfies with the guy. Um, but yeah, that's probably where, right? Yeah, probably. Unless you go into other toilets and <laughs> see loads of oh, shit on yeah. the floor. Which happens with places he goes to. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, fucking hell, right? Airbnb, no? shit's <laughs> Right, well, uh, last question, which is just, again, related to the fucking boring shite. Um, would you ever join the Navy? No. Army? Or... I was going to. What? Mm. Really? Mm. My family have a background in uh, the Navy, and I was like, you know what? I might me- need a bit more discipline in my life. And for about like a solid three months, I was committed to doing it. And then I was like, you know what? I like video games. And now we're here. And now we're here. Wrong choice. And now I don't play video games, so maybe it's still <laughs> fucking in the... Do you reckon you would then in future? Maybe for a month, just to see what it's like. <laughs> not fully commit, just to, like, oh. It's not and then just me. go AWOL. Yeah. <laughs> just rob a dinghy and fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> Good times. Got free dinghy out of it. Chris, would you join the army? Uh, yeah, I might give it a go. <laughs> right, that's have I'm you ever thought about like joining the army mm. or anything like that? You have. Mm. Yeah, well, I wanted to. Um, I wanted to join the police, didn't I? Yeah. I know it's a bit different to the army. <laughs> like. Not quite. <laughs> same level. British police. It's the same. You just put your police car in a river. That's all yeah. you need. Yeah, and then um, I didn't like look into it, but I've always sort of thought like I'd probably consider it. But then Effort. a bit of considering, I'm just like, you know what? And then I'd probably miss like tits or something. I don't matter. What? Uh, what? <laughs> Where are you going with this? Are you, this is the police force, the army. The army. <laughs> I like that. I would miss video games. He would miss tits. Fair. Sorry? You said no, didn't you? I don't think I'd pass the psych evaluation. <laughs> That's very you true. You couldn't give him a gun. No. <laughs> they wouldn't give him a gun, they would just give him a spoon. He brings I'd his own. Yeah. He'll turn up with his own gun. You know, it's, I'm not supposed to do this. <laughs> Turns up one. in a tank. <laughs> like, all right, lad. <laughs> yeah, I don't, think, I don't think they'd let me in. You should, like, sign up to see what happens, mm. and then we'll make a video out of it. <laughs> Fucking hell, this is going to go wrong. <laughs> Simon joins, joins the army, gone wrong. <laughs> the thing is, like, we do this like as a, like a funny challenge. Yeah. I'm actually in fucking <laughs> Afghanistan for two years. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but you so filmed the whole yeah. thing. Simon gets enlisted. <laughs> we force Simon to enlist. Yeah. Come on, doing the next podcast, I'm just, like, thousand yards stay. <laughs> <laughs> Blood still on your face. Yeah. Oshan, how about you? Nah, I just couldn't do it. Couldn't be surrounded by all that semen, could you? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh. That's not the issue. Okay. No, I just, I just couldn't be asked. And I hate people telling me what to do. Mm. So when some cunt's shouting in my face, like, just saying whatever the fuck, I'd just be like... Got something in your teeth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just, I just couldn't do it. I'd just hate them. Yeah. That's fair. So, you're joining, <laughs> aren't you? The army? What? We've enlisted him. <laughs> <laughs> Would you? Do you, no. you? Well, you went to army cadets, didn't yeah. you? Did, Did you? Yeah. I didn't. Know, well, I didn't remember this until the other day. Mm. How was, was that? Not full. <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't carry a gun. <laughs> Could you actually not? No. How heavy are they? They're pretty heavy. It was like the big wooden rifles. Like. Mm. Couldn't carry a stick. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> What's he saying? Yeah. But you have seen him. Look. You made a stick. Like, Simon, you know, like a Mosin. Yeah, yeah. That's, you carried heavy. a Mosin? No, but like that's like the type of model it was. Oh. Like, that's, you know what I mean? Like an SKS sort of thing. Yeah. 
That's like that. We yeah, should all go skeet heavy. shooting. Especially when you have to like leave we'll just go shooting people. Like we can go to why don't we go to a gun range? There's for a video. Gun ranges around here? Oh, not around here. There's a little ways out, but there are, there are in the country. Okay. Yeah. Do you know what you can do in Poland, which I don't condone whatsoever, because especially with our name and brand, but you can go to Poland and shoot a cow with a rocket launcher. That's fucked up. Why? Well, I don't Steak, know. Steak, I suppose. <laughs> Cook, doesn't it, when it comes down? <laughs> sound, <that. laughs> don't get any <laughs> ideas. No, how fucked is that, though? Yeah, that is fucked up. But you can also shoot loads of other guns for dead cheap, so... And another thing, you can shoot people for free. In certain places oh. in the world, yeah, sure. It's frowned upon, though, isn't it? Mm. I don't know, it's not what I've heard. <laughs> it's all the voices telling me. <laughs> 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 Fuck. Jeez. I'm dying. You're okay. <clears throat> um, so, you were saying before, Yeah. we enlist him mm. as a video idea. Yes. Is there any, like, in real life video ideas that you guys have had? That you'd want to do, just anything random, doesn't GTA matter. GTA in real life. <laughs> <laughs> well, we, no, just the like things I've thought of are super illegal, so you would have to like spoof it, like heist what? in real life, like GTA heist in real life. Oh right, you'll make a fictitious <laughs> set clown outfit. <laughs> <laughs> Should we actually just rob a bank? Yeah, let's just it. do it. I'll you take got... point, boys. I've got fucking practice in this <laughs> I don't know how well that's going to go because last time you wanted the police there <laughs> so no. whoever changed it wanted the police there yeah, fuck's just... sake Chris <sighs> stop getting involved <laughs> you're not invited to the heist <laughs> <laughs> <What? clears throat> alright uh, sorry I'll pitch in very quickly um, Payday 3 is coming out soon and I don't know if anybody's played that before, but I'm quite interested. No, it's not. No, yeah. <laughs> no, no when it off. comes out, fuck into yeah, that. I played, we played, I played Payday 2. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Is that any good? Because I want to yeah, try and get into it. It's a right game. Payday 3 Pay- looks good, though. Mm. Mm. Might be content in the future. It will be, because we'll actually fucking... Because we said about the forest, oh, yeah, well, mate, we're going to record videos on that. <laughs> we never fucking did. Yeah, but we can't. Why? Because Steven's PC will overheat and explode. <laughs> Every time he really? plays it, it's just it's fucking... Actually it's actually all right now. My brother fixed it. I don't it. believe My it. My brother fixed it. <laughs> he poured water on it, didn't he? And they went to like, the BIOS settings and stuff like that. Oh, so you actually have a decent PC now? No, it's the same PC. It just runs a bit better. Yeah. It doesn't crash. It hasn't crashed since then. Yeah, it hasn't crashed for a while, to be fair. You, but you... you haven't played Forest for a while. So. Yeah, because I lost all my stuff on it and I gave up. <laughs> yeah. it well, perfect opportunity to restart. Also, they've just updated it and it's like actual final boss now. And they've right, and let's get on it then. Because we could just refresh, start from fresh. Yeah. Well, there you go. Mm. Mate. Done, done diddly. Milkmen fucking meeting right here, and we've just, like, sorted it. Mm. We're doing it. Right, Forest. okay. One year too late. <laughs> That'd be the title of the video. That'd be actually quite good. <laughs> yeah. The Forest, but we're a bit late. To be fair, that's actually a yeah. good title. That's yeah. at least 65 views. Mm. At minimum. <laughs> <laughs> uh, where were we? I can't remember. You, you, you got star ideas. ideas. Oh yeah. Any other than that, Chris? Um, F1 race. Go karting. So Go karting. Go karting. Yeah. 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 But we the title it F1 race and it's just shitty mm-hmm. go karts. The twenty four hour thing. Is what I was thinking. That, yeah. Yeah. That was a good video. Mm. What? <laughs> There's a thing like it's a twenty four hour go kart race. A bunch of YouTubers go and they like they swap out every two hours and it's like constantly going around the track to keep time. Like Le Mans. Oh, yeah. that would be good, but fuck me, I could not be asked. <laughs> that, I, I mean, to be yeah, fair, no, you'd, yeah. you'd only be on for a two-hour stint and then you'd go yeah. off for sleep. Or only, something. mate. Do you realise how fucking hard it is to drive for ten minutes on a go kart? Your hands are like the whole time. Grow up, mate. Yeah. No. <laughs> Have you ever been on a go kart? Yeah, but I'm recently. Not. Yeah. But my dad, my brother, and my sister. Oh, yeah. On the same go kart. That's hard. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. Big go kart. Big go kart. Yeah. <laughs> Was it just a car? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just driving on the motorway. <laughs> I reckon no, that would be cool because mm. between six of us every two hours, that wouldn't be too hard, would it? Obviously, we wouldn't have to do that, but it's just go kart in general. That's what yeah. we came here. What about paintballing or something like that? I've never been paintballing. Quite interesting. Yeah, ever? No. Really? Oh, mate. Paintballing would be better. I feel like I would get way too into it. You'd see it, it as well. It does get like that. Oh, cool! Everyone's dying. <laughs> <laughs> I just shoot myself. I remember like the last time I went, we were they've got this big wooden castle, and you you were in it. You've got to defend the castle, yeah. and the, the the other teams come from each different direction, 
and it was like a movie, like you know when you like <laughs> when bad things happen, you got like that blurred vision. Oh yeah, yeah. And it's like 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 the the, the the whining noises in your ears. Mm. It was like that. I was like hiding behind this wall. And I was looking around. And I was like, <laughs> my teammates are like shot on the floor. And I was like, it's honestly so fun. Okay, we should, we'll, we should actually we'll do definitely that. do that. Hearing that really makes me want to make it in less now. I <laughs> really want to get him into Africa. Like, <laughs> imagine it. Oh, oh god. I got shot in the dick as well, like point blank, right in the dick. <laughs> How do you enlist? How do you do it? In the... Just Google it. And You're not you get enlisting into... me into the army. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Try and stop me. I'm trying to imagine you win a beret, and I think you pull it off. I'd, I'd look good in a beret. Look better with a machine gun. And a beret. And a beret. Only. Yeah. <laughs> Just no other clothes. That is it. <laughs> I no, but like I was bringing this up because I really want to start doing content. content. What? Yeah, <laughs> content. Content in real life, like yeah. you know, like out and about. And yeah, yeah. So we've got to fucking choose one. Should we go to an ice skating rink? That would be cool. <laughs> I'm I'm against the idea now. <laughs> um, any any other news that we've got to bring up? No. All right. Well, because. At the moment, obviously, in, you know, in the fucking world, yeah. in life, you know, in general, it's all shit. Yes. So I did decide to try and find some good news. Oh. Uh, and this is the best that I've found. Um, the world is getting safer according to the World, Bank, world Bank's latest homicide figures. And crime survey data from England and Wales crunched by the UK's Office for Natural, Na- National Statistics, ONS. Wait, hold on. The world's getting safer. Isn't there a new war on? <laughs> well, not here. Yeah, yeah, we're, we're all right. We're so not we're world, though, are we? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who's done this? And a bank is looking for the statistics. Yeah. I don't what know. They know? <laughs> I've found this somewhere online, and it must be true, right? <laughs> the internet's never lied, has it? No. Not really? No. No. All right, fair enough. Okay. But I just thought, I thought I'd bring in some good news, yes. you know? Yeah. Bring the, you know. That's light hearted. Bring the spirit up. I like yeah, it. Yeah, bring the energy up. Yeah. So, question for you. Yeah. What can we do different to stop this from happening? <laughs> stop the world getting safer. We need to, yeah, yeah, we need to reverse New it. Wall. We need to balance need things to roll out. Rob a bank. Mm. Rob a bank, dressed as a clown. Bring police. <laughs> <laughs> Have a shootout. <laughs> um, hmm. What that could is... we do different? Chemical warfare. Well, I know what you could do. <laughs> you <laughs> could just keep just driving illegally. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that's fair. <laughs> so what happened just before? Just a little side story. So we just go into the shop then. We pull into like a sort of sketchy road. I was leaving my car. And then my car, as I left, like, opened my door, it just screamed, mobile phone still in the car. Just in front of everybody. And <laughs> <laughs> advertising it. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Why does your car do that? Just, Are you sure it's yeah. not just someone in the back? <laughs> <laughs> you just forgot Danny's in the car. <laughs> mobile phone is still here. Yeah. So I thought, like, oh, that's good, isn't it? Now everyone knows. You know, if they want to rob me. It wasn't even in the car. It was, it was in my pocket. So, But anyway. they still rob. Yeah. Hang on. Why would any? Why would they go into your car and only rob the phone? Well, well, they could rob the car. <laughs> just, anyway. They just knew that, that that was in there if they wanted to rob it. But it wasn't. But it wasn't, no. Right. So that was fun, isn't the it? The car wants to be robbed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's sick of me. It's just like, get, this, get somebody else in here, please. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I've got an idea, and it's pretty shit. So you know that guy, I don't know what his name is, um, he treks the whole of Wales, but in completely straight lines. Oh, I love him. Yeah. Is so good. I would do that, maybe not Wales, somewhere more populated. I would get my Leatherman knife out, <laughs> aim it forwards, and just keep walking straight until I stab someone, and just keep on doing it. By the end, you're like a kebab. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I do. Nice. I feel like we're getting reduce there. the population too. Yeah, that's also alleviating a problem at the moment. You're welcome, world. Too many fucking idiots on on this planet. Um, so next question, and I'm going to start with you, Steve. If you could stop a crime from ever happening again, <laughs> but you yourself have to commit the crime, but after you do, it will never happen again. What would it be? <laughs> Genocide. Hang on. <laughs> Yeah. Fair enough, he's a good man. Yeah. I mean, the best, the, the easiest answer is, is Jamie's answer in it. Oh, I've seen it. Yeah, in court. Yeah. Flying in court. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, that's that a well good, good one. Mm. Mm. Uh, Fuck. Just, you can't I was going to say that. That's like the oh. best answer in it. You've yeah. got to rob it from him. 
mate, yeah. that is a mm. banger, isn't it? Yeah, isn't it? So like, did Man you do it? Murder. <laughs> <laughs> He's already done it anyway. So, yeah. Uh, Who would you murder? Fucking anyone. I don't care. Mm. I'm not prejudiced. <laughs> a little, a little, a little. Anyone can die. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, like fair. And but how like specific is it? Do you have to kill someone like? It's not know? like if you kill someone with a knife, then someone could still come, kill someone with a gun. It's like if you kill someone, that's the crime. Okay. It's like if you kill a specific person, oh, then fuck. Do they, already said if, murder. if you kill, kill a Christian, called Chris. Yeah. yeah. It's like he's already said murder. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Murder. Yeah, because you could kill someone that's about to die anyway. You've murdered them. Mm. Then you've removed murder as a crime. Yeah, yeah, you could. Mm. It doesn't That's have boring, to just be. It? No, mine would be like fully healthy, prime of their life. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Cut down. <laughs> just about to receive some really good news. Yeah, yeah. His daughter's on the way. <laughs> <laughs> One day from retiring. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's too late. That's too um, late because they're like, what? What's yeah. the retiring age? I'm 67. Something like that. Yeah, exactly. you need to get them earlier. Yeah, got to get them. They've just got their new job. The, the, the new career new so I'd, I'd yeah. still say it's too too late they've lived too much of their life you just want to kill children yeah okay Ellis <laughs> <Okay. laughs> I think mine's boring like vandalism or something like that yeah, yeah. like spit and chewing them on the floor and that's littering that's littering mm. yeah no, I just well that would be mine then littering there we go I fucking hate it oh you saved us yeah. well I mean, <laughs> thank you Oshan <laughs> yeah but of all, <laughs> the, of all the crimes I want to commit. It's like, well, I don't want to commit any. That's what I mean. Oh, you so, did, I mean, did just say you he's okay with murder. In. The amount of letter there is. Well, he's sorting murder, isn't he? Um, you're sort of done with me. You're sort. You're sorting. What is it? Perjury. Mm. You're doing. And um, I'll rob phones from cars. <laughs> <laughs> robbery. <laughs> just to robbery. save your own. <laughs> that isn't even in the car. Just car theft. Yeah. Mm. That's like something like just really inconvenient to people. Uh, uh, assault, because obviously it's that different means you to have murder. To assault. What? That means you have to assault someone. Yeah, yeah, just give someone a little slap yeah. in it. It's sorted. No, I'd go full. Oh, no, okay. <laughs> to within the doors yeah. yeah, they're an inch, of it, but <laughs> they're not kill actually him. dead. <laughs> yeah. And I'll finish them off. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good system. You rob them. <laughs> yeah. Rob. And then you lie in court about it. There you go. Mm, yeah, you're the God. witness. There we go. And you pick up the letter. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm fucking vandalizing oh, yeah, something. You, yeah. you, I don't know, I destroy a bus stop. <laughs> <laughs> um, have any of you ever seen a crime being committed? And don't say him driving <laughs> yeah. on the wrong side of the road. Um, you driving. Oh, yeah, I have. It's not a crime, mate. It's just um, frowned upon. I was in, this was the most like short story of them all of a crime. But I was in Liverpool a few months ago and I saw a chase of somebody shoplifting out of John Lewis, I think it was. And the guy was fucking like stocky and he was trying to run for his life holding this like really expensive jacket. And you could see the security guard booking it towards him. And uh, the, uh, the security guy kind of, not tackled, but kind of... Uh, my mum was with me and kind of fucking, uh, what's the word when you fucking nudge them? Just smash them, mate. Don't bump, say it. That's into. not the word to oh. use, is it? But um, yeah, so I'm getting a call in my fucking pocket. Um, <clears throat> might be my mum complaining about it. Um, but she uh, she was like thrown to the floor because of it, and I I felt the urge to chase after him and fucking kick the Wait, shit out of him. Your mum was pushed to the floor because this. Security guard kind of didn't see her and kind of she fell to the ground. Mate, I'd be helping the robber. I'd be <laughs> beating the fucking living shit yeah. out of the security guard. <laughs> the Spider Man meme. Is that oh, Mr. Yeah, Bob? Yeah, yeah. That's my problem. <laughs> <laughs> Let's him up the door. Who uh, was calling me? Was it my mum? Let's find out. Um, wow. Um, no, I'm trying to think not. of a crime that I've seen. Well, we've seen one together. Have Aww. we? That's yeah, so cute. I know it is, isn't it? Oh. It was them. They were doing it. <laughs> yeah. um, Bonnie and Clyde. Dogging. <laughs> <laughs> How did you know? Uh, <laughs> wait. Were you the one That's in the other car? Fucking hot, my dude. Um, <laughs> no, we were in Greg's and then we were in the line. Dogging and Greg's. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, we were in Greg's waiting in line 
And then we just saw a homeless guy walk in, grab a load of food and just walk out. No <laughs> one said a word <laughs> and everyone just started going, no, eh, fair. <laughs> fair enough. Like, Why do I not remember that? It was in Chester. Were you there? <laughs> <laughs> it might, I don't it know. It was just uh, you or something. Um, yeah. It was me. I stole the food. <laughs> I don't know. You might have been there. I feel like you were there. You just yeah, forgetful. Be, yeah. I, I, there was something that I do remember. I was on the way to um, to Emily's in Huddersfield, and then uh, next minute there's like a police like guy stop like stops me as I'm driving. I'm like, what the fuck? What's going on? And there was like a couple of guys like other officers like hiding behind like in like a gate like entrance to like, the farm or whatever. Mm. Oh, this is weird. Like, what's going on? Next minute. They uh, had a, like one of those stinger spike strip things, and they chuck it across the road right in front of me. And uh, Mondeo getting chased by a police car goes like literally it happens right in front of me. I'm like right in the front, and he like slams on his brakes and slides up this road, and he's getting chased by a. It was like a full on like police that chase after him, nice. and I was like so like what's that? I was like what's going on? And I was gonna film it, but then I was like oh yeah, but then there's police and I'm like driving, so yeah, yeah well, <laughs> yeah. So that was kind of cool to see that. Mm. But you don't need a Mondeo, don't we? If you're gonna do it, you may as well do it properly. Yeah. Yeah. So that was a bit of entertainment, wasn't it? It was a crime. Have you ever seen a crime, Steve? No. He didn't leave it? his room. What? <laughs> huh? Hmm? The only crime he's seen is like pirate theft or something like that, you know. He doesn't leave his room, oh, does yeah, he? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Fucking scum. <laughs> Need slap of that one, Chris. <laughs> Got him. It's not, it's not a joke, mate. It's probably all he's ever seen. Yeah. To be fair. Factual. What's right. the actual? <laughs> I haven't seen a crime. What's the actual pirate? Um, I've seen loads of crimes. I'm sure you have. We probably shouldn't talk about them because you've <laughs> yeah, you commit them. them. Yeah, you've probably no. committed half of them. No, not all of them. You nearly killed your brother by accident. Still, murder. Well, shouldn't have been in the way <laughs> <laughs> of a rock that you it threw. His fault. He stood under a rock. Yeah, idiot, mate. Fair. Wow. What crimes have you seen? Um, like. Assault and battery. Mm. I've seen houses getting bricked. I've seen like theft, drugs, weapons. <laughs> <laughs> Just the crime weapons. No, you know, like guns and that. Just thought it's like naming nuclear I've seen, <laughs> shit. Like... I've seen, yeah, I've seen mad shit. Of course. I wouldn't you, expect any less, to be honest. Really. You live a wild life, yeah. don't you? Yeah. I didn't ask for it. What it happens, mate? The life. Yeah, it has to be born. Yeah. Um, well, I was an accident actually. Just sort of bring that up. <laughs> I think I think I okay. was as well. <laughs> oh, don't act like you're a fucking <laughs> planned no, mate. No, I was just Fuck so you. random. No, because he, like... he was just like I didn't ask for life. Neither did I. Now me. Actually, did so anybody? Danny was the did only. Did anybody planned. ask to be born? Really? Yeah. Yeah. All right, fair. <laughs> what? I think that, like, Danny was the only planned one from my family. Mm. Was he? Yeah, he was. Didn't go to plan then. No, <laughs> no, we <it> did not. <laughs> were you? Were you guys? Were you? I know you. Mate, I you definitely were was. Fucking that. hell, yeah. Christ! Uh, Some, somebody, I, somebody I work with was asking uh, what star signs everyone was, just to, you know, they were interested in that kind of thing, and then they figured out that. Uh, uh, in the span of the time I, uh, to have a child grow, uh, I would have been the February area of Valentine's. <laughs> you were an accident. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mate, Damn. No one's planning it on Valentine's Day, are they? They're uh, planning for a nice time. Could be, it could be a planned night of passion. <laughs> <laughs> At six o'clock sharp. <laughs> <laughs> no. Mm. I'm Do you reckon you, what, so you were planned or not? I don't fucking know. Mm. That's all I know. Ask. I was a, uh, a Christmas conception. Were you? Yeah, because oh, na- I was nine months after Christmas Day. What was mine? So I'm April. What's that? I can't do maths. Like what? my birthday or something? What? I was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> Hang on a minute. Mine's, what? mine's like around Halloween. It Actually, July. no, it wouldn't have been. That's fucked July. up. <laughs> yeah. No, it wouldn't be because I was, I was a month premature. How was so, Fucking what? Really? Yeah. I'm you kind still of probably glad came about out that because you would have been the Hulk. <laughs> yeah, you probably still came out six foot. <laughs> yeah, well, that's like the doctors said when when I was like ill when I was younger. They said like my growth hormones have an imbalance. I've got way more than I should. Mm. They said if I'd done my whole term of like be, of of pregnancy, then I would have got Too the big. mega growth hormone. You know the one that makes people like eight foot, eight and a half foot tall. 
They said that would have happened, but you wish that happened. Didn't that'd you? be sick, mate. <laughs> really? And I'd only have like four years left to live. I was going to say, you'd probably be dead. Wide, <laughs> the wide shot of this podcast. You won't even reach <laughs> the top. Because you're never, never, ever going to stop growing, are you? No. So, you, like, what, how tall are you? I would be like ridiculous. I, probably, I'm 6'4 now. I'd probably be like, I'd only go to like 6'7, six, 6'8, six, something like that. Only. <laughs> <laughs> only. When you can't even walk through a door. <laughs> Yeah, no, I'll never stop. That's, that is mad. <laughs> it is weird. Stephen, were you an accident? I don't know. What were we thinking? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think we came to the consensus everyone here was a mistake. I feel like, I, no, we're all happy accidents. Happy accidents. I'm not fucking happy. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, if you haven't already, make sure to follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok with the handle at WatchMilkmen for behind the scenes and extra content, and also because you will get a six litre jug full of my spit. So, once again, at WatchMilkmen for all the social media. That's a lot of spit. That'll take a lot of time to get through. Nah, down that in an hour. Not down it, spit oh. it. Yeah. Fucking <laughs> hell. <laughs> Sorry. I wonder how much spit. No, that's not. <laughs> Um, a com- uh, so, Curdle Conversation, a conversation between the five of us where we delve into the hypotheticals and uh, f- you know what we're fucking doing. Uh, the hypothetical question for today, you have a button which when you press it, it does something. What does yours do? Kill someone. Make sense. What the fuck? <laughs> Immediately to murder. <laughs> oh, I, thought, I thought the question was going to be if you push it. Someone dies and you get money. I thought that's what you were going. Fucking hell. Why don't you just push it and get money? Why has someone got to die? Yeah, why has someone got to die? I just just thought that's why this question was going to be. No, it's just there's a button and when you press it, something happens, but you choose what it does. Choose what happens. But you can't ever change it. What I do is I have a button when I press Simon ejaculates on command. Um. (laughs) (laughs) Um. I'd just say, like, have a button and, like, a random person shit themselves. Just, just make yeah. it on yeah, the spot. Yeah, you're even in that pool of random people. It could be. Yeah, you. exactly. <laughs> <laughs> is it a pool of, like, the 8 billion people on Earth? Or is it just, like, a certain amount of people? Yeah, maybe I'd select them, like, yeah. Be like maybe a thousand out of, people. Yeah. And throw yourself in there for a laugh. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Out of five people. <laughs> Us. Yeah. All right, well, that's a, a weird thing to choose. I mean, you could have just said, like... Yeah, but it's funny, though, isn't it? Do yeah. you know what I mean? But saying right. giving yeah. money is boring. Yeah. All right, Marsha, what do you think? <laughs> what would my button do? Hmm. We get a new subscriber. Boom. Done. I like that. It's good, isn't it? Yeah. I wouldn't press it. Oh. What, would the, what would the button be? Subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> Get on. Got him. Hey. Nice. Uh, you're welcome, you're welcome. That was such a terrible <laughs> fucking joke. Oh, that was a pity laugh. Um, All right. Ellis? I already said it makes Sire Jack. Oh, sorry, yeah. Simon? Um, every time I press my button, a treasure map would appear Ooh. to a hidden treasure somewhere on the earth. <laughs> I could just make it so if I press it, I get the treasure. But <laughs> yeah, but you want the adventure. I like the yeah. challenge. Yeah, yeah. You said that like you have to find the treasure map as well. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. So many treasure hunts. <laughs> so you press a button and a, a treasure map will appear somewhere. But you don't know where and you yeah. don't know where to start. I have no way of finding it. <laughs> but you can press another time. Someone could find it. Yeah. Mm. And then I'd be like, see it on the news. Yeah. That was me. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> have you oh. heard about these really convoluted easter eggs video game do sometimes where yeah. like they go into the real life and you have to go oh, to yeah, actual yeah, places yeah. I mm. think th- shit like that would be really up your street I love it mate I used to spend hours on Battlefield looking for sharks mm. <laughs> <laughs> didn't enrich my life but hours <laughs> you used to spend hours yeah because they were like when the, when the Battlefield games first came out there'd be like people hunting easter eggs and it'd be like they'd be like Binary code and like Morse code, you have to figure out and all kinds of shit just to see a shark jump out of the water. Literally, mm. right? It's pretty cool. <laughs> Has everyone said what they do with their butt? Yeah, Stephen, haven't they? Stephen is you, are you just sticking with killing someone? <laughs> um, I don't know. You get a hundred silver every time you press it. <laughs> <laughs> is that our destiny joke? Yeah. Uh. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> what do we think uh, Danny's would be? We haven't what Stevens is yet. Yeah, I was thinking, do you know what? You know that the, the island with them people on that? Don't Epstein's have Island. 
No, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> the other ones be like, oh, the North Sentinelese. Yeah. Um, but every time you push it, a light show spawns above it. Above your face. <laughs> oh, <mate. laughs> and you it just speaks. torture them forever. What's wrong with you? It tends to be. Is this gone. more Destiny talk? No. What? What is this about? The the, the people of North Sentinel Island, that uncontacted tribe. Oh, yeah, they, 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 they oh right. And light show spawns above your face. <laughs> <laughs> They'll start to worship it as a god. Yeah. I was thinking about Danny. Uh, when he presses it, he sobers up. So he's just. Oh, mate, that's reset. a well good one. Mm. Immediately feel better, and you just press it. Yeah. I need one then. <laughs> it's his button. You tape it round, wouldn't you? So it's always on. Yeah. <laughs> you fucking uh, invincible. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mate, yeah. That you could literally, could be. Literally, yeah. Oh, cool. Right. Well, moving on to the bonus question. Oh. We all get stranded on an island. Mm-hmm. Who's the leader? Who organises everything? And who dies first? This is including Daniel, by the way. So who's the leader? Simon dies first. I'd say you die Why first. Why do I die first? You know who's killing me? Me. Me. Why? All of us. <laughs> we collectively just, just batter you. As soon as we get there, yeah. there's no like a delay. <laughs> <laughs> We've literally just got off the boat. <laughs> Immediately <laughs> Kill him. <laughs> We're not even hungry or anything. <laughs> we just know that we just don't want any of his shit. Yeah. I mean, yeah. That'd be a good getting... video as well, Stranded Island. Like Where are we fat where are we how Yeah, we... yeah. I'm fucking Fucking though. him on a boat as well. Oh what? mate, no. He he wouldn't even make it to the island. <laughs> He'd be dead before we got there. I'm like you're like trying to like plan an escape from the island and build in a raft and like, I'm not getting on that boy. <laughs> Leave yeah. me here. You stay on the island. <laughs> Do you know what I'm thinking this is how this is it'd go like this, right? We'd all be stranded. I was trying to take charge start organising things. Mm. I say, I don't want Oshan to be in charge. I'm going somewhere else and making <laughs> so my own camp. Cool. And then I'll go and I'll be like, I'll be at the head of like, another, yeah. Like another group of strong people. <laughs> You'll come back with people. I'll be like, have people like on a chain and we'll all four walking next to me. And I'll be like, I'd, I'll lose my mind first night. <laughs> like, like, I would be insane. <laughs> Make up your own language. <laughs> yes, yeah. and, and I'd just terrorise your camp all yeah. the time. So no, the people that just this halluc- just sounds like rust. <laughs> <laughs> so you are the leader, the organizer, and the person who eventually dies yeah. first. But, but I reckon, but he's like of, my of own your own. Thing. Yeah. yeah. So wouldn't then, you be people, mate? Just a lot of chimpanzees. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so yeah. Then the rest of us, mm. Who? So like out of me, Chris, Alice, Stephen, and Danny, who's the leader? Who organizes everything? And two different people. And who dies? It's either Stephen or Danny who die first. Generally, I think that. No offence to you, but... Mm. It's got to be, on it? Yeah. Yeah, Danny. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think you'd survive on an island? Even with our help? Well, dying first is a bold thing, because what are you dying of? Just boredom, probably. Yeah. <laughs> You're like, oh, it's not destiny, isn't it? It's not... <laughs> <laughs> Just go and drown yourself. <laughs> yeah, <it is>. <laughs> <laughs> Kills Kill himself. Kills himself. <laughs> yeah. All right, well, yeah, that. that's one. So who who would be the leader and who would organise everything? I think uh, Chris would, like, go up the ranks and become yeah. the leader that we didn't that's, expect. That's the thing. In those sort of situations, Yeah. not that I've had any experience, <laughs> but I reckon I would find myself... I've done these, like... When I was, like, doing my degree and shit like that, we did these, like... Oh... Go All right. <laughs> okay, yeah, so, yeah. Is it a flex? Yeah, just All right. flex it. Oh, I went to uni, I got a degree. Anyway, we did this like team building thing where we went like away. And then even though like I wouldn't like even think my think of myself as like a leader role, oh. I ended up just doing it anyway, because people just start pissing me off. And like you know when the people are doing dumb shit, like they can't see how to like solve mm. simple things. Yeah, but this is when you were in a class full of Idiots. Yeah, it could be that. It could you're just on be an that. island with idiots. Yeah. I'm not an idiot. Shut up. I reckon I'd, mate, I reckon I'd be all right for at least a day. <laughs> you don't even know how to start a fire without a lighter. Guarantee it, mate. Yeah. Do you? Yeah. Probably. Gasoline. I'll do it right now. <laughs> Match. <laughs> um, Flamethrower. Yeah. You've got to figure it out. Keep it coming, mate. Fireplace. I'd love to do that. Mm. The thing is, though, the question is, if we all get stranded, do we have stuff with us? No. It's Why just are we like on an nothing. island already <laughs> with nothing? Filming a video. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely, that would be a fun video. 
I want to do it right now. We're seen, all going to die. Have yeah. you seen the clip of that show when it's like random people, like these people stranded on island, and it's like men and the women. Versus women. Yeah, yeah and yeah. It, cuts, it keeps cutting from men women. Men are just like enjoying themselves. <laughs> yeah. They're going fishing. They're fucking jumping around trees. They're just like having an absolute whale of a time. And then the women are just like, I can't fucking deal with this anymore. I can't do it. And they're just like starving. Yeah. And then they end up going to the men's camp and just causing a load of drama. Mm. Fuck that. Yeah. Yeah. Luckily, though, they'd be the food source. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Well, right, you, can, down, you can do that in your yeah. own tribe. We're not going to just resort <laughs> yeah. to cannibalism straight away. I got, I got a tribe of chimpanzees, mate. No rules. <laughs> <laughs> they welcome you in. I reckon like, I'd be the leader of them and organise everything, and I'd die by them as well. Yeah. I'd bring them all to your camp, and I'd be like, order them to charge on you. And like, just... Wait a minute. These are actually just wild chimpanzees. They just tear me apart. <laughs> 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 So in our group, Stephen dies because he just can't be asked. Chris I... leads. Huh? Chris leads. We, we, we'll, we'll see if it works. And you organise everything. No, I would say Danny. Let's or... go surfing. <laughs> yeah, I just go surfing. Yeah. yeah, I'd say Danny would be a good organiser, like organising stuff. But then I'd say. I can't read. <laughs> what is it? To what, read? what is this to read? <laughs> He's not reading books on an island. <laughs> but then I'd say us three as a collective, would be, like, the leadership. The dream team. Yeah. <laughs> Get backed. I don't care, man. I got my own camp. Mm. You're dead. Like, <laughs> <laughs> you'd walk up to a chimpanzee. Oh, hello. Ah, and it's immediately dying. <laughs> oh, my God. Joe, you'd die. You know, Skull Island. Yeah. That guy. Oh. <laughs> I don't know if any of you have seen Skull Island. I've seen Skull Island. I don't know what you're referring to. That though. one guy that's just away from the camp. Yeah, because he yeah. gets, like, lost, doesn't he, on his own. And then he gets eaten by a fucking. <laughs> what is the manual? Is that like the King Kong? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I can't remember that. I haven't, I haven't seen it. Because like they, they all set off to go and find him, don't they? And he just gets eaten. Yeah, I just started thinking of that scene in Nope. You know, with the. Um, I haven't seen it. Oh, you know, at the beginning, mm. where the. The, the digestion. What? No, no there's a monkey and it just kills everyone. Fuck off, there's a monkey in it. Yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. watching it's now. The only good <laughs> bit about the film. Um, monkey. I'm just imagining you <laughs> <laughs> We're just making a big deal about what your camp's going to be like. We go over to the other side of the island, it's just one big leaf discovering your no, you corpse. Just... <laughs> <laughs> just face down in the sun. <laughs> but naked as well. That is how it'd be, mate. It's like you're, you're talking to no one. Yeah. You're talking, you're, there's like no chimpanzees, <laughs> and you're just sat there talking to no one. Oh, this fire's warm, just a hole in the ground. <laughs> I wouldn't be honestly first night I'd lose my mind covered in dirt just oh. somehow after one night I've got like really long hair <laughs> <laughs> a really big beard yeah. and everything you've lost teeth <laughs> <laughs> oh god oh fuck it right good okay uh, segment seven which is change game so two of the milkmen perform a scene based on suggestions from everyone else at any point during the scene the host can say change at which point the previous line of dialogue and or action is replaced with a new line of dialogue and or action. So, who is the changer? I think the last episode we talked about me doing it. Simon, do you want to be the changer? I'll do the changing. Yeah, Simon change and then it's me and you, isn't it, Ellis? Okay, yeah. Happy with that. I what remember is the what's scenario. The, what's the thing, Simon? So, yeah, so who are we, where are Snacky. we, and what are we doing? Hmm. That's going to sound so bad on the audio version. I well, well, you can cut this. You are I can't fucking wait. cut it. I'll <laughs> cut, mate, I'll cut you if you continue <laughs> eating biscuits. He's selfish, can't I? Like hmm? Jesus Christ. <laughs> no, I don't want your biscuit. I can, maybe. No, I'm on a diet. <laughs> I literally like have sandwiches. sandwiches. <laughs> yeah. um, right, okay, uh, I reckon... Thank you. You are old friends who have just met each other again Okay. in a carnival. A carnival, yeah. what kind of, just like, like you a, know, like with a circus, and it's got a, like a one of them big wheels in it. Okay. And he's dressed like a clown. <laughs> <laughs> he's dressed like so a clown. he's the clown performer. <laughs> okay, so one of us is dressed like a clown. Yeah. Who? Hey. I'm not going to tell you that. Oh yeah, work out okay. the story. Yeah. Right. Right. Okay. Right. Okay. You ready? Yeah. Right. Bloody hell! Fancy seeing you here, man. Who the fuck are you? Change. Oh my god, Dave. Yeah. Dave the Clown! Change. Yeah, just Dave! <laughs> oh my god, it's so nice to see you, mate. Oh my god. I know, how long has it been? Five years, I think. Change. One week, isn't Change. it? Change. A few seconds, I saw you last week. 
Have what? you got dementia by any chance? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say? Change. <laughs> Do you have dementia? Maybe. Change. Possibly. Change. Absolutely. Oh, right. Well, what have you been up to since I saw you last? Oh, you know, just kept on being a clown 24-7. You're a clown? Change. Oh, my God. I've only just noticed that you're a clown. Really? I wear this constantly. Change. I wear this to bed. You wear a clown outfit to bed. Why do you do that? It's very warm and cosy. Change. It's very uncomfortable. I don't know why. Yeah, I can imagine. But to be fair, I do like wearing clown outfits myself. Do you want to meet up and dress as clowns together one day? I'm mm, not too sure about that. Change. I really, really want to do that. I, I'm not sure if I should say this in public, but that really turns me on. I'm going to leave now. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't changing um, that. That was staying. <laughs> <laughs> is that it or do you want to keep going? I don't want to keep... This is uncomfortable uh, yeah. now. <laughs> I'm feeling a bit like... <laughs> like how do we go from really old friends to wanting to fuck I know, each other? Yeah. <laughs> um, what the fuck does that Did happen? you even mention... Where were... Where? In the carnival. Yeah, no, no one mentioned yeah. that. <laughs> yeah, just as the clown. It doesn't matter. Place. Yeah. All right, I'll see you next year at the next carnival. There you go. Done. Change. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> fuck. All right, cool. Has anyone got any... Mate, you keep I'm eating these biscuits. I had one. Wait, wait, wait one minute. Wait, Literally one minute. I've got the taste the one end. minute, Chris. You're such a fat little <laughs> fucking bastard. Do you know that? Hmm? Do you know how a pain that is to edit for Ellis? Because I don't do any of that. <laughs> Honestly, you're such a <laughs> selfish. You were definitely an accident. Jesus. I... Oh. It's all right. It's all right. <laughs> oh. It's okay. No. You can still do it now. I'm not speaking. To be fair, I'm not... Yeah, I know, you're not... You won't be fucking speaking in a minute, mate. You'll be dead. (laughs) At the press of Stephen's button. (sighs) Right. Um, Final segment. Mm. Simon's Milk Facts. It's where Simon says a fact about milk off the cuff. Go. Here's one for you. Did you know, per day, a cow can produce seven litres of milk? Seven fucking... Is that all? Well, it's a little bit under. It's like 6.6 or something. One, hang on. I really? can produce more than that. What? Hmm? Quit talking, <laughs> biscuit boy. <laughs> really? Is that yeah. all? That's a lot of milk. That is a lot I of mean, milk. I mean, hang on. How many... How, I, the big jugs of milk that you can get in, like, Tesco, yeah. isn't that a six litre? That's a pint. That's a six pint. Oh, shit, yeah. Idiot. I was thinking, <laughs> that's not a lot of milk for a cow. <laughs> no, that's a lot of milk. So yeah. six, six litre... Um, just trying to wrap my head around how much that is. I don't really work by litres. Four pints is like two litres or something like that. So, you know, like, yeah, like a four pint of milk, that's like a two litre-ish. Mm. So it's like three of them. That's still not that... I'm not yeah, impressed. You're not going to milk the cow till it's like red raw, do you know what I mean? I am. Don't say it like okay. that. Uh, you've got to think of the cow, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, but I feel like that's just a bit pathetic for cows, isn't it? Oh, don't slag off cows. Wow. They're trying their best. Yeah. Angus, don't listen to him, but... Mm. <laughs> I'm upset now. No, I feel like they could do better. I'll do you better. All right. I thought I was supposed to be the clown to do him. Oh, yeah. Wow. Okay. Do you want another biscuit? I might, you know. Idiot. <laughs>